Campus Newsreel recently interviewed Kent Mitchell, Director of Sports Information Services, and we asked him several questions in relation to our athletic standings. Um, Mr. Mitchell, how are our teams rated on a national scale? In football and basketball at Utah State, our basketball, as most of the students know, and most everyone in Cache Valley and the state know, have been in the top 20 all year. But to be in the top 20 is a definite honor, although you'd rather be number 9 than number 19. But to be in the top 20 means that there are about uh, 110 other teams that are not even mentioned. So with this in mind, you can see that uh, that is a definite honor to be rated in the top 20. In football, it's more difficult. There have been years where the Aggies have been rated in the, in the top 20 also. However, it, last year, the, the Aggies had a real good uh, season with uh, five and five, and it could have, could have been eight and two. It was just one of those years where it seemed like something unknown happened every week, and so consequently they weren't rated last year, but uh, I think that the time's coming in the next two or three years that you'll see the uh, Utah State football in the top 20. What are the prospects of our spring training in our football team? Well, Coach Mills is very enthused, as, as is his staff, with uh, the players that are returning, and they're very uh, high on, on the players from junior college ranks that have indicated they will be here. There are a number of junior college players already here, and especially linemen and linebackers, a couple of uh, uh, receivers. But we have a good nucleus in uh, Tony Adams at quarterback, Bob Wicks at, at the receiver, and uh, some good running backs. In fact, we have more running backs probably than most any team in the state. So he may use some of those running backs at defensive backs. So uh, it looks real good. I think you'll start spring training about April the 17th.